感到这样好。我说，因为我现在有参与每个星期三，啊，高雄线上读书会，让我啊有做一点功课。高雄读书会九九岁生日快乐！好，感恩明玉老师。首先，好，非常感恩直播初级，开心自己。非常感恩，无论您在哪里，愿意跟我们传法锤续缘财连线读书一起来，我们要一起往相互激励。说此际，相约文法新笃定，相信自己有潜力，永葆初心，正精进的方向来努力哈。所以刚才的回顾影片，我们掌声响起，感恩雅琪师姐，感恩到、哦。那同时间呢，我们今天还没有看大爱台新闻的时候，呃，大爱台我们要看的哪一出？哦、oh, ，Hello everyone, this is the The、uh, Kaohsiung Online Study Group、uh, welcome you all to another session of exciting and energetic program. I would like to say that there's so many positive、uh, feedback on our program. This is to say that it's so wonderful to be able to be with you all. 是真的没有想到会，呃，你没有想到什么样的人会给你怎么样的回应。Well, I wouldn't expect, uh, what type of people will give you what type of feedback. Uh, as long as I can help someone, maybe someday, uh, someone will come, uh, return to help you. 乞丐婆回馈家人的那一碗白米饭，让慈济志工陈满从小种下善念，即便后来罹患重疾无力症，在鬼门关。Well, this is、uh, another case、uh, story of how someone was helped by 慈济 ，and、uh, even at the time when she needed the help most， 慈济 has appeared to help her。Well, we have different types of energy that we can use to help different people at different times. Well, it's really、uh, amazing to be able to make use of the positive energy to be able to act out the script. 随风随缘的上个星期，亲临主场的。一个新闻哈，那现在我们来看一下，这礼拜天我们要一起追的影展是什么？ Uh, like next, we'd like to tell you about the what is the upcoming program in Thai TV. Well, sometimes we in life journey that there may be that last journey that you need to accompany someone. 天，我们一起要追的剧是。Well, this coming Sunday, this twenty-fourth、uh, of、uh, April, let's、uh, chase the program. 如数我闻，这一则都非常的。不是少。Well, this、uh, video tells you how we love little animals. We have to open our mouth. We have to love, the,、uh, even including those that are related to to it. Well, we will like it. What do you do about it? When we deeply love someone and with no regrets, what do we do? Then we must know that if we love someone like our animals, we must not put them into our mouth. Well, this is a really a heavenly place for our children. But look what's happening to the world today. Well, some adults have really ex exhausted the resources of the earth, and what is left for our next generation? Let's really do our part. To make sure 
our earth resources are preserved. Well, the earth re needs you, so let's uh, quickly make sure we act. So, masters, ideal talents are, what are they? Modest, not arrogant, pure with self-respect, cultivated, uh, wisdom, always holding selfless love, and treat everyone equally. Be open-minded and control our temper, work hard and harmoniously with others. Show good etiquette in speeches and action. Be enlightened, virtuous with a purified focus on general principles, not on trifling matters. So with these above characters, uh, they will be qualified followers of Master. Well, Master, be, be assured, we would like to be that person that uh, you would like us to be as a follower of Master. And uh, definitely Master will give a thumbs up to you. Yes. Well, if nobody gives you a thumbs up, give yourself the thumbs up. Well, you are the Dharma messenger. Pass on the Dharma mindfully and pass on the great Dharma. If you love Master, then you will need to talk more about Suji. Well, Master, give us the blessing in uh, 2020. Uh, we really... Uh, I'm grateful to the Master for giving us the opportunity to be able to spread the Dharma throughout the world. Uh, we, other than the uh, online uh, translation, we also have many uh, transcripts uh, going on at the same time on different, different languages. So we definitely will uh, work harder to make sure that uh, every everyone around the world will be able to listen to it, no matter what language you speak. So you can see, even as we uh, are talking, our uh, Taiwanese uh, translation team are also working hard. Uh, now we have got uh, 10 uh, languages that are doing translation, and all together we are 133 uh, volunteers. Uh, thank you for uh, Guorong Zivei, Rui San, Xiaoqing, Yili, Yi Mei, Yu Yan. Then we thank you for the, the, the uh, Cambodia uh, and then the Cantonese team. And then, of course, the, our Philippine, uh, Philippine team as well. And a bit very thankful for, for you. Ying Lu, Yi Juan, Pei Zhen, and then Jia Yi, and um, Miao Ling. So we're really thankful for all the positive feedback that's coming our way. Well, even if we are, no matter how busy we are, we still have to come on online to uh, make sure we play our parts. Uh, even the uh, slight changes uh, as we go along the way, we make sure we coordinate well. We are uh, not worried about changes which come our way. Well, we very, uh, one of them was very touched by the uh, bone marrow uh, donation program. So many of them are touched. Everyone is full of uh, positive uh, energy. Oh, we're really thankful for the all opportunities. Uh, so, he would like to take opportunity to uh, promote vegetarianism in the community. Uh, because of the mutual encouragement given by everyone, he's truly encouraged and wants to carry on the uh, promotion of vegetarianism.
and all the positive uh, feedback has even good her to encourage more to come online and join the uh, Kaohsiung online study group. Uh, although sometimes when we are being interviewed, uh, if you feel uh, that you are not up to it, but because of the experience, uh, if you gain a greater insight and also uh, be encouraged to do more for city and for everybody. Well, let's uh, come together because everyone is uh, talent. Well, in 2023, uh, look, then we're going to have new team coming on. Thank you for the Kaohsiung uh, team. And we have so many others. Uh, and we have Zhen Yu, Chiu Lan, Su Man, Zi Hao, Zi Guan. There's so many of you, uh, we cannot uh, introduce you individually, but we're definitely very, very happy. Well, we have 248 uh, uh, feedback and uh, 107 shares. This is definitely a very active uh, platform. Who is Hong Yuting? Oh, Hong Yuting is someone who has just joined us in the positive feedback uh, section. Because March 30th, he, he, he went on online and realized that uh, the uh, Every Wednesday program is so exciting. So as a result of that, she has followed ever since and uh, even participated in many, many sessions. We would like to give uh, Yu Ting a special compliments. Uh, Kaohsiung, uh, Yu Ting has joined us as well. So we have Zhang Xue, Yu Ting, Yu Lu, uh, all Jian Ming, all, all taking part uh, in helping us to do the reading part of the book card. And definitely, not only do, do we help others, we also in the process also help ourselves. Oh, now we also realize what, what uh, people in Myanmar are doing, and how all this is truly encourages. She, she didn't realize that despite her age, she's able to still uh, participate as well as contribute. And she's already uh, 80 plus. So you can see uh, age is no barrier. As long as you have the heart, the willingness, you'll be able to contribute. Well, although we may be old, but uh, heart is not uh, old, we are still very young at heart, so we can definitely, everyone, no matter your what your age group, can continue to contribute. So, I must say, you really, truly encourage me, and I'm really be able to... Uh, participate and be able to contribute in my small ways. 
Uh, even people in Jordan, despite the uh, uh, time difference, the time zone difference, they, they realize that wow, such exciting program on uh, Wednesday uh, morning. Uh, so she has continued to watch and follow the program. Well, one of well, them say that well, if, when I reach 84 years, I hope, hope I can continue to uh, follow this uh, online study club, which is truly amazing. So all of us will really have to uh, show our beautiful part and make sure that uh, the positive contribution goes unabated. Oh, it's truly encouraged by uh, Manchu's sister Manchu, who is able to uh, continue to contribute. And as year in and year out, she has always been helping us and contributed positively to the program. Uh, we truly uh, also feedback uh, that the, truly the people who uh, played out the, the programs in the play and the dancers, they are so uh, energetic and so encouraging. Malaysia's Liu Zifang was also highlighted as uh, being a good friend with the uh, Australian group. I have feedback from Canada. Well, he said that it's truly the the untainted love exhibited by uh, the program uh, through the program able to see how city love can transcend all the barriers and definitely will benefit the global community. We are very grateful for all those who have left your positive feedback online. Well, many positive feedback about Dr. Li, how he has not left Tsuji despite being there for 20 years. Well, our Emily Kwan, Shirley, our Annie Liao, Sunil, Lily Ku, these are all giving positive feedback. So it's so important to leave what you feel after the program or during the program. And the YouTube uh, sister Effie. Sister Effie said they have been watching the Dai drama series. As it brings us back to our grandparents' time. But it brings them back to the grandparents' time. So Sister Effie has uh, learned to love Thai program ever, ever since coming to uh, Kaohsiung online study group. Because that period of time, there's definitely a very heartwarming time and people are more down to earth. So some of them do not watch uh, online at the same time, but uh, leave until the end of the day. But even at the end of the day, when they watch the replay of the program, they are also uh, touched and also want to continue to watch the program. 
先看到了，他们是不是会觉得笑起来甜甜蜜蜜？所以不要小看我们每一个能量，我们的软质鱼很。Well, do not belittle the little uh feedback that you have. Uh, of course, uh, Elizabeth, as usual, has, has uh, done very good caricatures of uh, the different sharers. Normally, we go uh, overseas to uh, to have someone who share from another overseas, but uh, because of certain changes in the program, uh, today we are going to have someone that's different. 是我们台北的建林师兄哈，那大家可以看到是这边有两张，这是我们芝加哥的执行长，呃，雅美是的 CEO of Chicago， 然后在这个当下里面，他昨天天就给我一个讯息，那个讯息就说现在是 Give me a message three two days ago， 所以这表示什么？ Oh, say that we are still having snowfall。Normally we don't have snowfall in April, but this time there is. So Chicago is still falling snow. So you can see the the April weather has、uh, gone cold and. So you can see the.、Uh, Climatic changes that are so real. So Dr. Peng say that uh, this this uh, wind waves have really changed our uh, weather. So they they still cannot keep their winter wear because、uh, really the weather is still pretty cold. By right, it should be、uh, spring, but yet we, we don't see the signs of spring coming on very quickly. And in the central zone, we can see that the 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 thunders are pelting down. So, so this year the 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 water is going to water level is going to rise. So it's definitely going through、uh, a period of thunder and rain. So it seems like in two or two one, we actually have one thousand two hundred episodes of、uh, the thunder pelting down. Jia Yi, Tainan, and uh, uh, and another area is、uh, truly among the top most pelted down in terms of thunder and lightning. 呃，彭博士呢，常常就在气候的一个会议的时候，就是到各个地方去代表慈济去发声，然后去推动。那这两位呢，其实也是我们团队，一位是雨。So、this, these two are actually from our team, and、uh, we realize that the vegetarianism、uh, has really gone global. 去参加了以后呢，就回来，回来跟上人。Yeah, after they have done the tour of the area, they will come back and report to master. It's not because we have、uh, finished our meeting then the climate change is going to end. Of course, climate change is going to continue unabated. 各国专家齐聚讨论的议题涵盖六十多个面向。这次最重要的一个是碳市场要出来了，每件事情我们做一些消费，它的碳的成本是多少，就会变得更清楚。So every time we consume something, we have to realize how much of、uh, carbon footprint are we creating. Actually, global change is not just affecting a few countries; it's really a global change. 
Even in the the way we discard our old handphone is also affect、uh, climate change. Give you some statistics in year 2020, and just looking at the eight different type of matter, and just looking at the eight matter, we actually have、uh, recycled 400 tons of、uh, waste matter. Can you see what is the impact if we don't do that? And because we we did the recycling,、uh, instead of mining the the metal, we actually save thirty five three hundred fifty thousand ton of、uh, carbon. So you can see the impact is truly huge, and we must continue to、uh, ramp up the recycling effort. 那同时间呢，彭博士让我们知道的是，它在气候这个部分，可是，在零碳。So it's、uh, truly that、uh, our actions in re recycling and helping the earth is goes as a big global impact. Hopefully, hopefully before we reach two or five, or we can really、uh, increase our saving of.、Uh, Carbon footprint by hundred times. Sorry, by hundred percent. And these are the、uh, videos of、uh, what we have done in the past. So basically, when we consume a, a lot and increase our carbon footprint,、uh, well, this is going to be ongoing. So it's something we we cannot、uh, lose in our battle against it. So today we go a slightly more insight into this program.、Uh, Now we would like to welcome Dr. Peng Qiming. We really love you to be with us because you have got positive energy. Uh, uh, oh, hello, everyone. We are very happy to be able to be with you, and we already know that we are actually facing the climate emergency. Uh, we would like, we would like to see you、uh, in person. So maybe you can uh, uh, show yourself other than just、uh, PPT. Okay. <laughs> uh, now we can see. Now we can see him. Now we like to share、uh, using the PPT. 相信待会同步的时候，我们记得这样的一个解说呢，分享。哎，很棒，我们掌声响起。啊、okay. oh, ，wonderful， now we can see。谢谢。好，那各位师兄师姐，大家好。我今天呢，这个 Dr. Peng is the general manager of Better Risk Management Development Company. He is also the anchor of Thai TV Better Station. So his program today is facing the climate emergency. 五十二周年，那今年的这个主题呢，叫做“投资我们的星球”。所以，我们这个地球。On the 20th of April, we have the uh anniversary of this uh program. We have this uh research, and uh, we in two o three o uh California State, uh no more no more engulfed by wildfires. So it seems like. A good news. Is it really good? 
Uh, but it's because uh, because uh, the the previous wildfire has already consumed so much of the forest, so that's the reason why there's no no much wildfire because not much more left to burn. So this has become a very global trend. Why is it that we uh, esteem the weather change that is going on around us? Well, sometimes because of our weather change, we, we can actually cause us to stop work. Isn't it amazing that such devastating effect can happen to us? And then our uh, cost of uh, production is going to go up. And because cost of production will go up, uh, less people can afford it, and uh, our the con consumption of our uh, product will be less, and the orders coming in will definitely diminish. Our uh, environment, society, uh, will will have uh, positive. The impact us and the people may uh, withdraw their funds and their investment. And this will definitely cause us to have uh, financial difficulty. In our uh, World Economic Forum uh, in 2022, we had a global report of uh, global risk. And we divided uh, our period into three different zones uh, from zero to two years, and from two years to five years, and from five years to ten. So basically, these are the three periods that we are looking at. And every single time we reach a different period, we can see different statistics. So every time we come back, we say we hope the, the next period is going to be better than the previous. But is it really happening? So we can see that, that they are truly, uh, we are truly threatened by what is happening here. So from the period, we can see paradigm changes that is happening through the global, uh, global climate scene. Despite all the pacts that have established, realized that uh, some major countries like America have withdrawn from the pact. So, we, so when, when Trump came into power, immediately they withdrew from the pact. So our effort to gain a positive climate change effect is taking a setback. We'll pass on to Sister Siu Ching. So our new climate pact is uh, more ambitious, but we hope to uh, limit the global warming to 1.5 degrees centigrade. But of course, you must understand that 1.5 degrees centigrade is our ideal uh, aim. Uh, will we achieve it? It's still a question mark. So sometimes we can come up with many ideas, but sometimes we may not be able to realize it. So sometimes despite our idea of 1.5 degree, uh, we still reach a region of uh, 2.5 to 3 degrees climate change. Maybe looking to the future, maybe by the year 2050, we will be able to achieve a better standard and be able to reduce our global uh, 
carbon footprint by much more and help to uh, reduce the global warming to, or the speed of increase of global warming. So next time you look at it, whether you're Japan or you're USA, the minute you do, you do not take care of uh, the impact on the global uh, the uh, carbon footprint, you will definitely increase your cost of production. So we really have to uh, all have a collective effort to make sure that what we do will will definitely bring about positive effect. So, pass over to Sister Xiu Qing. The latest uh, report shows that that uh, there are more and more people uh, getting paying attention to this, um, to the 4% are uh, paying attention to this. In fact, in Taiwan, there are uh, main uh, uh, corporates like uh, this uh, Aztec uh, Alta and you all as uh, Asus, they too. Internally, they also have their own sustainability program, uh, recycling. And uh, we could see that in Taiwan, all these uh, big organizations are uh, together. They are trying to uh, okay work together to sustain Mother Earth uh, with this uh, good culture and uh, maybe the good pressure from everyone. They have to do this. It and others are doing it. I may as well I do it with this. Uh, six uh, six already announced that they are uh, in compliance. So they hope they can do it earlier. Now that everyone has grown, and we hope that in future there are 100 families could join this. Uh, last week, a uh, professor, he said that he could say that the, those uh, frontliners, they are trying to bring forward the rest from behind to do this, uh, join this effort, climate change effort. So hopefully all these uh, big corporates, uh, they could uh, inspire the other smaller ones. But in reality, facing this uh, climate, uh, climate, it's not only eating vegetarian. It's not, there are many other things that we need to do. We need to uh, reduce the carbon uh, uh, emissions and as well as many others. Uh, uh, we have to influence everyone, be it the corporates or even the small children. We have to influence it. It's all from our attitude. So uh, the corporates, they are working hard uh, on this sustainability. They are professors also opening some classes uh, in university, uh, joint effort with other university, other places uh, to inform the public as well. In the past, uh, uh, to inform everyone that facing this uh, climate change, we are not sure what to do, but uh, we thought that in the past, uh, I don't off the aircon, uh, maybe I walk, I don't use transport, uh, uh, I eat more vegetarianism. This is uh, all the 12 years ago. <laughs> A poster, uh, that's how we're doing in presently. What should we do? We have to uh, adapt to the present means. Uh, uh, the housing, uh, we have to do zero carbon waste and water. All these resources, it must be uh, zero wastage. Actually, there are a lot of uh, new invention, and uh, it's not easy on this path. Global, we look at this uh, share of uh, low carbon sources and coal in the world, electricity generation in the future. Maybe we explore nuclear, wind, solar. These uh, definitely will be on uptrend. In, uh, maybe in 30 years uh, to 2050, uh, a lot of things uh, will be different from what we are seeing today. So now every country, uh, they are trying to uh, do reduce the uh, carbon emission. We hope that it could uh, go to zero. So in future, our living, there are some ways. Uh, every country, uh, they are pushing towards this, uh, recycling, uh, the agriculture, the way we use petrol, uh, how do we wash our plates, uh, our, uh, all these uh, things that uh, we can still improve. Uh, uh, simply, maybe to share the... During April 6, uh, climate change 2022, uh, the mitigations of climate change uh, using the, uh, in the six assessment report, they everyone agreed that this is happening and it's getting worse. So in history, it's getting worse at the peak now. If we don't do it now, in the future, we don't even have a chance to do it. 
In the past, uh, we are not. Uh, we have tried to keep the one point five, but the fact is we are not on track. So we have to do it fast. The difference is that first, uh, the solar, the wind, the solar. In the past, very expensive. Uh, now they have reduced uh, this photovoltaics uh, to reduce the cost uh, for this uh, solar tapping. So more people could use it. So to do this uh, carbon emission, we have to do it now. We don't wait until 2050 to do it. We have to do it from now. So all these, uh, including the animals, uh, discharge the methane uh, from animals, we have to uh, control it. Means uh, twenty seven percent cut in animals raising the animals. Uh, they have every country, everyone. They have to be part of it to be. They have to do this. So we have to do it now, not twenty fifteen. Else, uh, we have to uh, maybe twenty seventy. Only we can do it. It will only reduce by two. It will reduce uh, by two percent instead of one point five. These are the traditional methods available in every sector. They can at least half the emission by 2030. Uh, uh, be the energy, land use, industry, urban building, and transport. This time, uh, they have uh, uh, they mentioned about demand and services. And if uh, demand and services, uh, we could uh, have a major change. Uh, let's look at this uh, part energy, like this. Uh, uh, maybe in the future, we have to reduce uh, fossil fuel. We can't use it long any longer. We have to use uh, uh, solar, the wind, zero coal usage. Second thing is uh, on-demand services, uh, potential to bring down the global emissions uh, by 40-70%. We uh, take the bike, bicycle. Even the shirt, the shoes that we are wearing, all this uh, requires the materials to be changed. And uh, of course, vegetarianism, it can help us. Uh, the computation, this is so long. We could change our uh, living. We can reduce by 70, uh, 40 to 70%. That is very uh, encouraging. We were talk in the past, we were talking about, about vegetarianism. We are also talking about combinations of vegetarianism and the way of our living. So long we could do it together, our lifestyle change, we can change it by 40 to 40 to 70. This is actually in fact faster than uh, if we change the dynamic of the uh, industries. Uh, example, this is a good friend of Prof. He's, uh, she's uh, Zhang Hui Mei. A few years ago after vegetarianism, she has uh, published this book. So everywhere she will talk look for friends, those are eating meat and uh, they will bring them to the veggie restaurants. Uh, that are very good. Uh, they have this Michelin standard, the very good restaurant. So it created a trend. Like how sure they have a special uh, three Michelin stars. So they're naming this, uh, giving this uh, restaurants a uh, Michelin. This is uh, so they want everyone to come and eat veggie. This is a trend that everyone is trying to create. Prof is thinking if everyone they could uh, have this. Uh, upgrade all this with Michelin standards so that more and encourage more people to eat veggie. Of course, at the same time, we also have to be mindful that uh, that the meat, uh, because of the increase in population, it's on increasing trend. So more people are eating meat uh, because there are more people, the demand is more. Uh, actually, this is what we are all very concerned of. This is the chain of food. There are a lot of ways we can do it. So basically, Master said, we need to eat veggie. It is true. This is only way the remedy. Another important is the price of the food. Oh, we know that the, the soybean, a lot of grains, recently is an increasing trend. Oh, because of this, uh, you see the peak it created the highest amount in the past because of weather. We never thought that it's because of Ukraine war. Even the smaller grains, it's also on the increasing trend. In the past, uh, normally because of climate, and uh, a lot of countries that are poorer, they will have difficulty in finding food. So it, it will make worse, more wars will happen. So the safety of the food, food security, so if you imagine that it, it's, uh, it will threaten the food security, many countries could not eat it. 
Oh, and I imagine a lot of grains are somehow they're using it to feed the animals. Uh, it's getting lesser amount for humans. Another part on the transport, like there are a lot of technology. Uh, so the next car you must buy or you should consider electric or the uh, hydrogen, the futuristic. Even the places that we are staying, the cities and urban areas, we have to encourage uh, this uh, green, sustainable living. Another part is the building, the future or, uh, is, must be net zero emission. So when you buy future house, housing in future, you have to see whether they are zero emission. So if uh, it requires a lot of, that, uh, a lot of uh, electricity, a lot of uh, aircon, so we have to stay in a uh, more environment friendly housing. Each of us, we have 80 to 90% we are spending indoors. So how to really spend indoors at the same time we could feel more comfortable, at the same time reduce the carbon emission is very important. We hope uh, to uh, be mindful on this thing. The, uh, a good friend of Prof is uh, the, uh, another principal he mentioned in building. He said facing this uh, flooding all depends on us, on, on the relationship between us and the earth, uh, we have to uh, be more mindful to have a more harmonious so there will be lesser disasters, uh, reduce the carbon emission. Truly, as we uh, buy housing or materials uh, to improve the house that we're saying now, because uh, it can create an impact a lot, 25% on the environment. Another part is on the industry, using materials more efficiently, reducing recycling, minimizing waste that is currently under use, so we have to uh, be mindful into these materials. Not only Taiwan, uh, the whole worldwide, they are looking into this. This is uh, something learning to join this. Another part on this uh, removal of carbon dioxide, this machine, this machine will absorb uh, the uh, carbon. This is good, but then to absorb it, meaning you have to uh, install a lot of, I mean, install this, this electricity, right? Ah, oh, then it's back to that. So, so we are trying to uh, have this, I uh, think of more ways uh, to remove the uh, carbon dioxide. Uh, plant more trees, uh, that is definitely better. Uh, good way. Like land use right now. A lot of us like to do uh, okay, uh, faster way of farming. We have to be mindful of the organic or non organic. We have to uh, take care of the land, it's very important. At the moment, facing this uh, climate change, this year is about closing investment gaps. Uh, what is it to invest? Because uh, we found out that presently, this earth uh, to manage the 1.5%, not only government or everyone. When we do investment, we have to be mindful. So meaning the financial flows three to six times lower than levels needed by 2020 to limit warming to be low. So we have to re reduce the financial flow. So be mindful of that. So it requires everyone's effort together. This part is to do, aside from us, our change in the daily living, we need the change in the policy, regulatory and economic instruments, effort from the government, that only it is more effective. We have been trying to do this, uh, like a friend of Prof, he was been trying to uh, ask every restaurant, uh, through the restaurant, the vegetarian restaurant to promote uh, the personal effort. Uh. Okay, uh, sorry, the friend is at the government side. They are trying to use the policy to promote the, uh, uh, encourage the veggie restaurant side so they can, uh, so it's a good uh, cycle from the authority side. Other parts like technology and innovation, uh, hopefully to push for low emissions down through technological innovation, not the present one, uh, maybe not so effective. We, all of us are to be more creative uh, to change the environment. So basically, the evidence is really very clear. It's not about uh, to like keep doubting it. So the time is for action now. Lastly, uh, the proposal. In the past, we often mentioned about our living. We have to eat more veggie. 
you have to use a recyclable clothing, the living way lifestyle. Uh, with the announcements uh, on six uh, six of April, it's uh it's really very clearly stated that we have to change the living, uh, make investment properly into industry that it has a uh, zero emission. Each of us we can do it, but if we require more concerted and earnestly from everyone to encourage more to join us uh, and together with us walking on this path, not only changing our action, we also have to implement to uh, practice uh, the new change, all this. Uh, uh, we hope that everyone can accept and join us and connect with our uh, international family. If we could have this, uh, then we could uh, participate more and the uh, whole worldwide, everyone can do it together after they understand what we are doing. This is to create a good cycle. Uh, it is uh, another thing is uh, not to not necessarily always to have to have uh, our activity, and then we have to uh, be mindful if all these uh, uh, each of us could adopt the green uh, attitude in life. We are very grateful to Prof. Uh, Peng. Actually, you can talk very fast, and uh, and our <laughs> transcript. Three teams, uh, their hearts also beat pumping faster. You still have extra 10 minutes. Do you want to share more? Okay. Or even your laughter is full of en energy. And maybe you can think of some stories. Our Thailand Tsukwan sister said to 1.5% increase uh, is a great uh, issue that everyone has to do it together, family, industries, and government. Uh, eating vegetarians also the lifestyle so it reduce the carbon emission. We are very grateful to Prof Peng for the reminder. If you have any more reminder, please uh, share with us. Uh, we never thought that from the beginning, we thought that uh, the zero emissions uh, uh, is like from a uh, handful looking at the story uh, because the number is really alarming. It can tell thousand stories. So Professor today uh, has given us a lot of info for us to know that at this present moment, we need to quickly join this effort. Uh, we need everyone's effort at this place. Uh, we would like to pass this time back to Prof Peng. Can remind us more? Thank you. I have two stories. First, just now in the beginning, it mentioned about uh, being struck by lightning, right? Actually, the whole white they have more lightnings everywhere. They have it. Actually, the lightning is quite serious. No consequence they've been struck by it. Last time they said <laughs> the lightning will strike the bad people, but actually it's not longer. So, so you have to be ob observant of the weather forecast if it's a dark and the rain coming, lightning, don't go out and strike by this lightning every year. There are people being struck by lightning. I'm not sure any of you have such experience that if you're really struck by lightning, it is very serious. Uh, actually, not only surface the skin burn, but can be worse than that fatal. And we know that it's getting worse. So everyone be more mindful as you walk out. The second is... Uh, just now, the Thailand sister mentioned, I have a Thai friend, a very close friend. He is a, 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 a minister in Thailand two years ago because uh, before the pandemic uh, reached, uh, he came to Taiwan and uh, came for a visit and I brought him to uh, uh, recycling uh, afternoon. There was even a recording on that and he was so touched because he never thought that uh, all these uh, elderly bodhisattva recycling volunteers would be there so diligently doing with recycling and they cherish Mother Earth so much. He was very tough. And this year, I with Professor Pearl, he received the friend's uh, news. Chai Chai. Uh, how Tsuji uh, in Thailand is operating if uh, Thailand in Tsuji could also uh, participate more in uh, recycling and uh, everyone can do more in Thailand. So in future, we hope that every brothers and sisters from Thailand can help him. Because as a child, I heard that he, he is, uh, he's being transferred. Apparently, he's being promoted. He made his election. 
I'm not sure of his political party, but uh, but we are together. We must uh, support all this uh, effort to uh, love Mother Earth, uh, cherish Mother Earth. So, so uh, asking Prof. Uh, asking if uh, City Thailand can uh, help us uh, to uh, get more, inspire more in Thailand to join City. Another one is uh, these two days. Not sure if you notice in White House, uh, US, they have a notice in announcement. Every year, you every every year, two to three percent they are spending on budget for the climate change. The risk because once the typhoon comes, it will cause a lot of havoc. So US side, they estimated the budget that maybe up to seven percent. Wow. So we could look at this. Uh, it's getting uh, bigger, the higher amount. If you don't want to increase from two to seven, you may as well increase your investment in uh, protecting Mother Earth now. That is something what we can work harder on. Example is like maybe what you have seen the industries. Uh, today we could see that some kind of uh, factories, I mean, industries, they are trying to reduce uh, carbon emission. Like Prof. Hung, he said during the COP26, he that point of time he saw UK Glasgow 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 agreement uh, so that everyone uh other countries uh, they could uh, participate into global uh, this uh, global emission re reduce it so they can only re uh, invest com uh, the companies can only invest in companies that uh, has uh, these uh, policies in the green companies this uh, some people are talking about this uh, washing. They because uh, all the companies have to do it, uh, So there's still some company if uh, under unethical one, they'll use another way to do it. Uh, so have to be mindful. So we are very grateful to the addition stories from uh, the Thailand stories. Uh, so we are very grateful to Thai Thailand. That's us one sister. Because of her feedback now, you can inspire uh, Prof Peng. He really have uh, friends uh, connected to everywhere in the world. Actually, he aside from uh, taking part in this breeze weather, this Prof, Prof Peng is also has also undertaken a lot of tasks uh, to take care of this Mother Earth. So that uh, Japan sister is also very grateful to uh, Prof Peng. Thank you. And uh, vegetarianism is not enough. We have to do more. We have to care for Mother Earth. Uh, to invest our Mother Earth, uh, this uh, depends on our action. So her sister also very quite wrong. So Pichin sister also very grateful to this uh, Prof Peng for this uh, sharing. Safeguarding Mother Earth is something what we should do. Everyone's uh, effort to uh, vegetarianism all, all start from you and me when over sister Tuan Sing Ling, they said, oh, yeah, in the past, they said, well, recently there are a lot of uh, this uh, ball of ice, you know, big and small, destroying the havoc to the housing. So it becomes like a bit uh, critical. So because uh, everyone ultimately will be this uh, climate refugees, so it's scary. Only vegetarianism can and reducing carbon emission can save us. So we are very grateful to Prof Peng because today is very sincerely uh, wish to come, but because of the uh, pandemic, so that's why last minute uh, we changed it to uh, online, but it's still very professional and we can listen and can see. We really miss you, need everyone's energy to love and protect Mother Earth. And we're very grateful to Prof. Uh, we hope that uh, you can come again to share this uh, platform is not uh, created by me, it's uh, by this office. Very grateful. Uh, applause. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, next, uh, can I pass it to next share? Uh, translator, Kaan. So there's uh, visitors online giving feedbacks from Malaysia and saying that uh, hope the Malaysia government can pay more attention on the environment problem. Um, so, um, Helen and like everyone who is coming online and then posting online from everywhere and 
And we appreciate everyone saying their comments, and please feel free to put comments and then leave comments on our Facebook live. And then we are going to do a call a call out to Sydney in Australia. And we really appreciate the CEO from Australia. So they are they are doing a teaching lesson about how to make uh, their students. They are having class about so we are having a lesson how to make things and they were saying that you have to put love in it it will make it tasty and also uh, earlier before the tzuji goes into Australia people feel like it will be hard to have a it starts in Australia, mm, but the truth is they actually work really well. So they do not start from individually. So like they are leading others in the group to work together. Um, so the CEO is sharing about how they cooperate and leading others to work together. And then if it's positive and if it's cracked, they work it together on it. And so when they, uh, when it was the testing part and then they saw like people are making changes about their looks, um, so even they just cut their hair and it looks more positive and it look more happier than before than the past year. So uh, we also invite the sister of uh, Brother Li Jun. And this is the picture that uh, Sister Li Di is from the Cantonese speaking team. So they were super busy locally, but they still want to do the online translation part. So this is the sister of the CEO in Australia. And she was teaching people how to make the flowers. And in Tsuji, before they learn it, they haven't knew a lot of things, but because they tried and then they learn it, so they can do lots of things. Now let's welcome CEOs from Australia, Sydney. Okay, so both of them are online today. So, user one is welcome, brother Song Gang. 
上次的可以分享的感恩，我们口译一开始的英语口译，我唯一打出去的两通电话给执行长，其中一一通电话就是给。So we ask, I have to ask them to join the translate team, and maybe say it in the agreed. So the this year, all the sharing online was the original and、uh, orienting all the things. Then, Mister Min, everyone who is online, the masters. Hello, everyone. I'm Xin Gang from Australia team, and I'm going to share three parts today. So first is the the thirty years anniversary in Tsuji. The second part is how we cooperate with the schools、uh, during the COVID season. And then the last part is the Tsuji. Uh, orientations. So first, I'm going to share the 30 years anniversary. So, um, so during uh because like. Covid, we have to make the online or、uh, we have to make the orientation online, and、um, we make the online music concert.、Um, so we did on YouTube, on Facebook, and、um, Zoom. So it was like. Uh, one thousand two hundred fifteen-ish people.、And、they also had people visiting online, but because the COVID, uh, we cannot have everyone in person. We have to follow all the instructions of the COVID. And then, uh, so at the beginning of the concert, we were looking back about how the. Uh, pass of our school, how pass of our years has been go through. So, um, so on the picture, uh, is the first person is me, um, in nineteen ninety one, and this is the picture how the early years of uh chatting time, and then this is. The pictures about、um, the CEO from Xin Xin, and we also take some pictures.、Uh, so, like we create a place from、uh, the CEO's house, and then we make on our own city house, and then. So now, how it looks like in Sydney right now. So this is how we've been going through since the past thirty years, and also、um, Master has encouraged us to try to keep moving forward, and then stop.、Uh, and then eating more veggies, stop eating meat, and. Protecting environment at the same time, and then we still need to work really hard on that.、Uh, and also hope this COVID will give more, give people more reminders. And then this is how, this is the pictures who we took during the thirty years music concert at that time. And、this is the picture contains、uh, from 1992 and then until today. So it was a long time, and then、um, everyone who saw you saw in the pictures, they are from the older years until today. And then it's a hard way from us. And I came to Australia in 19, 1996, and because of Sister, I joined the Suji team. Then,、um, 
from from the beginning i just joined and then just participate and then until now i really feel appreciable and enjoyable in this whole team next i'm going to share the uh sydney to g school and how we did the celebration but because the because the covid we weren't able to do a big huge ceremony so we can so we can only do it during under the limited restrictions of the covid and then uh everyone who want to come so this this time uh still because the covid we cannot uh we we cannot have everyone come at the same time so we let different people come at different time from different grades and then from different age from different class they come at the different time and also ask them to wear masks all the time since they come into the school and then uh, until they left the school so uh so we are following all the instructions of the covid restrictions in australia and um also because the this hard time uh the government school are really are really supporting us and we really appreciate they give us opportunities to have this chance to hold this and then this is the uh this is the the sister the sister from taipei went to sydney and then joined the activities as well so like they're playing local games playing uh and doing choreography and also give them chance to do some vegetable foods and then during this time we can see like during this covid hard time uh except for us to except for me to have the feeling to really enjoyable with all those kids also at the same time giving kids opportunities to uh say thanks to their parents and which also makes me really touchable and also this gives chance to the kids to learn there will be opportunities for them to help others as well and then the next part is also because um like when we talk about the covid we still like really have it covid cases in australia it was still a huge amount it was like 50,000 people get infected because the covid almost every day so we need to pay more attention on that and we also have this school activity uh we, we also want let them know that um not only follow the instructions of the covid but also we need to know how to make it better and then how to use our own power to to let the covid time pass and then the last the third part is about the uh the waterfall during the uh during australia from uh may from march to from february to march and then so like this is all the pictures about how the climate changed during past several years in australia so like uh forest fire covid and then water water disaster and then um it makes everything in australia so hard even also because of the covid and since we are facing all this hard difficulties and the sisters and brothers in australia they still try their best to uh still try their best to work together to conquer this 
difficulty time. And this is one of the pictures that uh, we are helping the local peoples to facing through to try uh, to conquer through this difficult time. And we also uh, really appreciate the young Tsuji volunteers to help us to make the quarantine place and uh, helping us to join all the activities we have been did through. I just want to also let you guys know that it is important to follow the master's staff to do the to do what we supposed to do, do to follow instructions and then to uh, eating vegetables, protecting environment. That's all my sharing done. And we really appreciate brothers Egon's sharing and because we haven't really looked things seem carefully about how the climate change um, how the vegetable uh, how the climate change in the past several years um, we really appreciate you guys are in Australia to doing all these activities. And also now we hope people can eat more vegetables. If you're eating, if you're eating vegetables every meal and the earth will have more better environment. Getting brother eating. So there's also a lot of people uh, who post on the Facebook live chat. Um, really appreciate Dr. Pong uh, to collect all this environmental data to let us know how much it has been changed for the climate. And also, please also send some feedback about brother Egon's sharing from Australia. And the brothers and sisters in Beijing comment that please, uh, please pay more attention to the environment. And then Australia was really good. Was was so pretty. Let's just help hope us to can get back to where it we used to be before the COVID. And also hope the COVID in Australia can be uh, less because the high effect high effect of the uh, Australia we hope it can be getting better soon. And hope I really appreciate everyone who's coming online. Mm -hmm. Also, also said um, it's important for everyone who uh, work on the climate change. Everyone work together to facing it to change to make the changes. No. Let's go back to the uh, posters. And now we have two, 24,000 and two followers right now. And also, please also feel free to more, donate more. And, and this is also important for everyone to contribute. And everyone, I really, I really appreciate everyone who make all these posters, the people, the group who made all these posters. So, so this is the development of 
died, and, and then we we they did not make they did the purpose of they made this is not to make more money. This is just because we want to make more make less economic problems, and then they have night night light light flat up. Reflect light, and they have really soft inside, and they also, if you get a little bit dirty, you can just wipe the tap, wipe the top really easily. And if you buy it, and then you were able to get, uh, get a. Clocked back and also will make more people feel less stressful after wearing the shoes. After wearing the shoes. And the next part uh, is also uh, the hand cream, and because the COVID, like the, most of the hand hand sanitizers, including some alcohol, uh, so we had this. Um, we had this veg vegetarian um, hand cream, and then this will make the hand feel less hydrated, and also it can uh, it will have the effect of cleaning our hands as well. So this is the. So these are the pictures uh, where we sell it, and then um, so it's already on um, 3.0 version. And then this is the uh, laundry detergent, and this is how how it works. So like uh, you can use it. You have you will have the instructions on the box, and this is how you see before using and after using do the comparisons. And if like there's some area in the house will make you feel stressful or like feel uh, more uh, more stressful because it's a little bit dirty, then you can use the laundry detergent to clean everywhere. It's not can be using a laundry, but you can use for cleaning as well. So if you can do the candle candles more clean than before, and also you will able to see the instructions as well. Um, but uh, also, except for the Jing Si uh, cleaning powder. Mm, there's also a lot of a similar product online, but how can we make everyone feel this one is different? And then Master says this is more, uh, th this is more protecting the furniture, protecting the towels. So for other products, if if you can buy in the store, it will be, it will be. A little bit destroy the product or the furniture or the towel. So if you buy, if you have the zinc uh, cleaning powder, you are able to protect everything. So this is one of the brother who, who before using his hand was like hard, really hard to wash, and then after he used it, it washed it so clean and like. See all those differences before and after. And also, everything you try to sell is we are using to protect the global health. And also, we can see it can be used in many areas. So it's called. Jing Su cleaning powder, and like see how this different uses. So like this is the sink in the kitchen, I think. So you can just spray it on the sink and then put some paper towel on it, 
and then make it more cleaner after several minutes. And also, it has some discount as well. Also, I saw it's free type as well, so please also feel free to take it. Look. So there's no destroy, um, and also it will make everything more clean, but also protect, like do not destroy it as well. So we also have the cleaning powder and laundry powder as well, and the herb and tea as well. Um, so just 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 use it every day and then do not think do not overthink me about it so people can choose to not have their rights but also it's important uh, for them to have influence and this is the sister from Phoenix. So she just shared several days ago, and after several days, she shared she went back. And after like the second, the second day she went back, um, she she gave the feedback to us. And then, but we I just know that before last night, uh, before she come to sh come to share, uh, she had a really bad sleep last night because she has three kids and then um she she needs to take care of all the kids and then kids was worry about the younger brothers and then they try to they want to sleep with her in the middle of the night and then she was really really tired when she arrived she was kind of tired when she arrived but after when she started sharing and then after she started hearing others' reflections, uh, she started feeling more positive. And then she feel like, oh, at worst need to take uh, th like almost three hours to be here and then stay here to listen to everybody sharing. It makes her feel so powerful after the, the night. And also they said they uh, they don't need something really food special, but like just a, just something uh, she can feel happy. And so they they give her the Mexico uh, Mexico food, and then she said her husband uh, really really like the Mexican food, so she also really appreciate. We give her the Mexican Mexico food, and then she also feel really happy after all the sharings, and then after her heard all the um, touched or sharing from everyone. And then uh, this is a sharing from Chen Chun Lai, and then um, he said that everyone who is uh, in here are like trying their best. They are. Uh, they are working so perfectly as a as a team. Like they co-op so they cooperate so well, and even I don't need to say anything. We don't have to rehearse. They still did a really good job, and so so like they have seven people come here, and then they give nine uh nine feedback to us. And then this is from brother Zhang Zhang Xi Yi, and he also shared about um, all this, all this uh, co-op, all this great great sharings on uh, in person, and also uh, other brothers share that um, there's. There's like three. There's great leaders make great make great teams. So he said he said that um, because we had a great leader and then we we did a great sharing 
great organizing work and then make all the team so grateful and uh, make all the team so powerful. <laughs> so he was really touched. And also um, he, he was having a difficult time uh, when he's uh, when for the past several years and then he also felt uh, really touchful that everyone worked so hard to support him and then everyone was working so hard and then there's uh, there's uh, from Sichuan. He said that um, he also said that after he go back uh, every month, every every weeks we did the online part. He, um, even they are doing in person, they still feel super powerful about the team. Um, he still feel how everyone. Uh, in front of the screen, uh, uh, behind the screen, work so perfectly together. And also, um, the sharing of the reading center is so powerful and like so helpful. So he feel like it was really good experience. And then also like. Um, he was really appreciated that uh, this was from Sister Ding Jing. And she said, like, the good part will be teaching for everywhere. And then, um, so if it's some something not really good, it will go to her. And she was willing to listen to it. So she was really appreciate the brothers and human beings sharing about uh, giving the patients opportunity to use electronic ear so help them to hear more things and then she said hope they the people who had a elect elect electronic air who can have who can only hear the positive things about them um, who can have more positive things after they had the electronic air. And uh, he, she's also part of Telegope uh, um, Team. Today, Today we will share the footprints from June 16 to June 24. Talking about showing kindness with a heart and a have gratitude and diligence for blessing. 56 years ago, uh, Suji started. Uh, Master has uh, taught us to have a complete love and kindness and to cultivate uh, good living habits like uploading precepts and uh, have a person's uh, temperamental personality. Master's uh, Daniel uh, uh, taught us uh, how to be a good disciple, uh, to sit upright and uh, sit like a bow, where the eyes are focused and uh, focus on the shadow and conveys the respect to everyone in the silent teaching. Now let us just watch a video from Master. Uh, the best uh, medicine to address this current pandemic is to change our eating habits from meat to meatless. This is wisdom and a magic remedy uh, to embrace a vegetarian diets. Only human beings 
can create a clean and sustained, unsustainable, uncontaminated living space, giving people, animals, and nature a healthy life. Let us have a cultivate a good uh, living habits. Master advises to love animals and love all people around us. Have correct living habits. Look at now, uh, you know, uh, city people, uh, they are having good demeanor, the way they eat. Uh, to cultivate, teachers to cultivate such a good demeanor in our living ways, uh, our habits. And uh, it's must be saying that uh, vegetable, vegetables, uh, roots, and fruits are enough to supply our body's uh, nutritional needs. So we should not pursue for uh, meat or other uh, sharp things as delicacy. We should not uh, pursue and uh, look out for sharp things as nutritional value. So we have to, uh, we should feel blessed so that uh, we have a righteous, uh, righteousness in our heart and have no evil thoughts so that our society will be healthy and peaceful. Uh, we encourage uh, people to uh, donate, to do kindness by a small donation. Hope that more goodness uh, prevail, okay, so that we have a healthier uh, society and a peaceful society by doing good deeds. We have continued to uh, create blessings for ourselves and for the world. Now let us watch this video. Yeah, there is a, a group of uh, sisters and brothers uh, having a charity sales for dumplings. Within two days, they have to make uh, all these dumplings for charity sales. Uh, for the purchase of vaccine. Uh, this is the point was saying that I'm helping to do this dumping, uh, a little effort for me, so that uh, there's uh, enough uh, supply of vaccine um, to uh, have a better and a safer environment for everyone to live in. Look at these two uh, photos. Uh, this is uh, the, the medical team. They are holding their hands uh, with a love sign. They have dedicately uh, and devoted their time to uh, look after all the uh, patients. The more uh, one person uh, embraces the vaccination, the better is the uh, environment and good for everyone. So we have to encourage uh, more people to uh, adopt vegetarian. Even doctors, uh, doctors from Chelsea hospitals are uh, present at the uh, lobby to encourage, to tell the people that vegetarian diet is the way. To our to good health. So when patients are diagnosed with uh, sickness, doctors are always around to share with them that there's a need to switch to a vegetarian diet. And uh, here are the statistics to say that uh, if one embrace a vegetarian diet more, the faster the recovery is as compared to uh, meat uh, eaters. So our medical staff are always encouraging and promoting 
uh, vegetarianism to all the patients who seek help from the hospital. So all these uh, advice and methods are now uh, slipped into our hearts and minds that, that we have not, uh, this is a special thing uh, to a from Master that we should not only love people but also love animals and all things around us. Not only that we love uh, people, but we also must love the earth and let the land be safe and uh, the people are also safe. So today's our topic is to uh, plant good seeds, plant kindness with a heart and uh, with gratitude and diligence to create blessings. Mm, this is uh, our brother. Um, oh, is a, a teaching teacher. So as a share, he always asks that uh, whether is it correct, this or correct, that we are very good to the brother to him. So he's sorry, and he is always ever ready to help. While children and his family are all uh, involved in such activities, and with his great one, he has never stopped. Uh, contributing. Brother Zihau is a team uh, lead for this uh, particular segment for guided reading. So uh, we know that our medical team uh, continuously uh, explore and uh, new avenues to uh, new avenues to protect and the environment. Now we have uh, other teams to join this uh, conference or uh, online study group. And uh, as uh, more and more people uh, take on responsibility in, uh, in our translation, in our Western translation team, we are getting uh, stronger and stronger. And uh, from all the feedbacks online, we can. Uh, go further. And uh, this particular uh, online feedback comes from Australia, uh, but uh, we should embrace uh, vegetarianism and uh, letting more one person embrace uh, meat plus is already uh, an achievement. So another feedback coming on is uh, from Canada, is that very grateful that they are uh, able to join a city for the past uh, 30 years. They are able to learn from their brothers and sisters here and giving positive feedback, so drawing all the positive energies. We are grateful to all the uh, online. We encourage uh, uh, more and more people to contribute, uh, no matter uh, how uh, tiny or how small their effort is. So, so as we always said uh, in this second study, we do not need to be uh, good in order to start. All we need is a dream. We has a dream. So as we practice and we, as we do, we will become uh, better and better. So after all, we need to be uh, put in more effort and be diligent. So here are all the uh, different groups from our uh, brothers and sisters from other from USA. 
Be compassionate and are always ready to plant fields of blessings whereby we can gain wisdom through doing good deeds. It's a sister from Lin Peiyu from USA. All these are the, uh, positive uh, right tops. Uh, cross border coming from different countries, like US and from uh, Myanmar. Let the path be filled with uh, paved with the runs of goodness. Always create blessings and uh, take this uh, pandemic as a growing lesson for us. Let us change the great the challenges into the causes and conditions. As long as we contribute peacefully, it's already a good, contrib a good contribution to the society. Mm -hmm. This sister is very uh, excellent. She can write a uh, very poetic uh, feedback, uh, which can uh, encourage us further. Mm -hmm. We have to call out action, uh, call out to uh, Mamma to for the sharing with her. Let us all embrace a vegetarian diet and plant based. And the reason that ITV uh, shows a writing graph in life, so always uh, speak good words of goodness to create a good affinities with people. I think I shall pass this. Uh, let us uh, give uh, encouragement to all our uh, teams, members from all the countries, whether the interpretation team or the written translation team. Shall I pass to Ms. This particular brother who provided us the feedback that he was very deeply touched with the sharing from Jordan, where there are so many body transfers. And uh, have uh, encouraged and deeply touched the local. And on that particular day, the locals themselves are not uh, independent to contribute to the local society. And uh, it's all through the efforts from uh, Brother Chi Hong. Until today's day, the image of uh, Brother Chi Hong who moved down. Um, still uh, very clear in his memory. So according to this uh, uh, sharing, that until today they still uh, visit the place where where the most uh, where the Syrian uh, refugees are most so it's about um, in April 6, she heard about the, uh, the uh, sharing from uh, this doctor. Uh, we should impress her and deeply touch her. And, that uh, the, the medical uh, the medical research and expertise shared by uh, Dr. Lee last week uh, that can um, enable a person who have uh, difficulty in hearings or uh, hearings 
uh, can have a new lease of life by this uh, new uh, technology. So she was very impressed with Dr. Wu. And all the sharings from the Dr. Wu about the medical things and how the treatment they have helped the patients touch her until as she listened to the sharing, she was tearing away. So uh, all these uh, feedbacks, uh, uh, our recent feedbacks are from our uh, diligent sisters who give us uh, motivation and uh, encouragement to those sharers. So it's because of the uh, harmonious and unity of the uh, two team that have brought the uh, goodness in everyone and then can provide uh, so much uh, positive energies drawn from the sharings from all these speakers each week. So many stories and uh, life, true life stories are being shared and uh, which have uh, deeply uh, changed uh, other people, transformed other people's life. So she will, this system, she will always uh, focus on uh, one speaker and uh, will write up the words of encouragement. This is a story of the because of his uh, of her illness, she, she has uh, burned down the whole house. And uh, this is a lesson from RS where her life was transformed uh, when uh, cities uh, when they stopped him to care for them. So in mainland China, we also have uh, teams from uh, involving in the uh, return uh, translation. Uh, many of them are very talented and have uh, expertise in uh, various uh, fields. They are gathered together uh, in unity to present their performance for us to enjoy. Now I shall pass on to uh, Barbara and our sister Fiz. So 进入我们每个月一次的时间文青大爱之音，好，一起来，我请到何丽。好，第一天的第一天，第一天，第一天，第一天，第一天，第一天，第一天，第一天，第一天，第一天，第一天，第一天，第一天，第一天，第一天，第
um, to develop a good habit. Let us see what are the other healthy 21. Yeah, thank you for the this video that have been prepared by uh, another brother. Yeah, it's related to the healthy 21 days challenge. If we want to go to another area, we have to um, apply, have to be uh, centralized, uh, centralized, isolated for medical observation. So uh, they will be uh, transport to send us to to send us to another uh, to send to hotel for isolation. Brother Wen Jie ha have take the opportunity to, uh, de to develop the reading habit, uh, alone, alone time in the room. And this is really uh, very cherished about this time alone. This is the um, healthy 21 um, Meditation retreat. Uh, Brother Wen Jie have gave uh, him a, a goal that is to have 10,000 steps per, per day and have matured this uh, good habits. And after these 21 days, uh, all these good habits will be there in our daily life before he doesn't have this uh, good habit, but with this 21 days healthy, healthy 21 uh, retreat, is able to nurture this good habit. In this every day, in, during the time in the hotel, he has his own time and and have his, take this time to do exercise, to have a healthy body. Before he has been very busy and do not have his own personal time to, um, to to read books and do his own stuff. So with this uh, 21, the healthy 21 retreat in the hotel as a form of isolation, it has nurtured his good habits. And in this hotel for observation, medical observation, um, the environment was uh, very uh, proper and uh, always take care of our health, um, the, the, the cleanliness of the room and also the food that is uh, provided. They will check all the most of the things in the room to ensure that it is free of uh, the uh, virus, the pandemic, the COVID virus. This is a healthy uh, isolation uh, in the in this hotel. Uh, the food that is provided will be provided uh, at a fixed time and they will knock the door and says that, oh, it's time for meals. Every, every day, there are five dishes and one soup, variety of food and a rainbow colors meal. Uh, when I reach, when we reach the hotel for isolation, it is already past the dinner. However, the dinner was provided and uh, and uh, how do uh, the hotel know that uh, we are vegetarian? And and when open the dish, the provide that the dish that is provided is not uh, vegetarian. However, they will they say uh, they will get the kitchen to uh, provide the vegetarian in a in a short moment. The dishes vegetarian dish was provided. So uh, so. There is one thing that uh, they didn't know that uh, seafood is not considered vegetarian because they worry that uh, we do not have enough protein. Therefore, they provided the shrimp. Uh, 
chicken and eggs for us. And after explaining, they have uh, understand that uh, vegetarian is no meat is uh, purely plant based. Uh, tau tofu uh, uh, all con have sufficient uh, protein. So they have provided protein uh, thereafter. They have provided tofu dishes thereafter. In in this uh in this isolation area, uh the environment is really very good. The the window is uh top down and have this sunshine uh provided to us. Uh it's really healthy. And the medical team they really uh, protect themselves very well and and, and they uh sanitize our shoes and the whole body everything was sanitized and they provide and they protect themselves and they also provided a uh, gift small warm gift for us and really feel warm about this and uh, all the things that is required to be used are all very sufficient for us and and uh, they will always remind us to wash our hands frequently and sanitize our hands. And there are different plastics for us to uh, to throw our rubbish, and it will not be um, the rubbish will not be in the room for a long time. Therefore, the clean our uh, the room is very clean. And uh, the medical team will come in to uh, take our temperature, and there is no our uh, papers and the temperature were submitted via our mobile. Yeah, it's aging technology. There is no physical interaction uh, except the temperature, taking the temperature. And there is this um, uh, group of uh, humanity group which come in and ask if we have uh, any other thing that we require. It's really very warm. Uh, the medical team really have, uh, have, have analyzed and provide a lot of uh, medical uh, a bright of protection measures for themselves and also for the guests. And every day we drink uh, Ben Chao Yun, Jinsi Herbal Tea as a protection. And we also drink um, protein or Jinsi product to, uh, to for us to have a uh, healthy body. And yeah, we also do exercise in these small areas. Yeah. What? See, this is how brothers and sisters can exercise in the room, in this small area. Wow, oh, fantastic. Yeah, in this, let's give them a, a, a pause. Yeah, teacher may say, they have to put in effort as well. Yeah, they can do, a, have done a lot of different variety of uh, exercises like Zumba, Aerobics and this uh, using this TRX equipment. Uh, it take about one hour exercise every day, and this we can have this good habit to exercise in in the house internal. Uh, now I would like to show like what are these different different exercise and the things that you can use. This is uh, stretching. Stretching. And we, we have target to have exercise uh, until that we are sweat out. Even though we are not able to go out, but we are connected to the uh, outside through the internet. 
that they have uh, used their ex uh, exercise equipment and rubber band for exercise. And uh, sister brothers also use the water bottle as a form of exercise that is used whatever that is in the room that can be used as a exercise equipment. Has to um, provide, have to give some a uh, goal setting for ourselves what we want to achieve. After and we have these two children uh, who are also in isolation in the same hotel and uh, to sing the thank you thanks my language to the medical team or the, that have been taking care of our, our service, of our health a really grateful to, to the hotel uh, or the medical team in the hotel that's serving us. Yeah, isolation is with love and care. Yeah, it's a warm in this uh, pandemic which, which has caused this isolation, but it is with warm and love and care. We have witnessed the isolation with love and care. We have accepted the love and care from the isolation in the hotel. It is uh, medical uh, investigation that uh, I am safe and able to leave the hotel and reach out to our destination after the 21 days. We are here to let the goodness, utmost goodness. I really feel that most of them they are really uh, good. <laughs> the <laughs> sister Mei Yun, uh, husband has been beside and while watching brothers and sisters exercise in the hotel, I've reminded Shu Mei Yun that actually can do at the exercise as well. Yeah, really grateful that the uh, applause to brothers and sisters who have been isolated in the hotel and have done two times of broadcasting through hotel. The change in climate is an issue to everyone in the world. Of the world by having vegetarian meal every day. Jinsu,我可以为大家见证哦 we have to follow the instruction in using the product of our jinsu. 
Uh, doctors, it is easier uh, for doctors to promote vegetarian. Uh, teacher Su uh, book study is very, very gentle and warm. A lot of praise to the book study group. Using Jin Si to, to appreciate and uh, others and create blessing. After some time, using songs to uh, as a book study, there are many book study group and only uh, able to provide to able to join or share one or twice in this uh, uh, book study. Let us invite the acting group. Here I meet you, and, and I have this story to, sh to share. What story? I'm very angry. Why are you so angry? The anger will cause will impact the climate. Who say? Master Chen Yan say. Master Chen Yan say, my my calm the climate will be good. If you're angry, our blessing will be gone. That means we have to be we have found good affinity and say good words. That's right. Professor Fong also says the same. Uh, I actually say want to invite you for exercise. I would like you to do this exercise. Let's come, let's do together. Tinker, tinker. Let's uh, turn our hand. Rotate forward. Three, four, five, six, seven. Change direction. Flower bloom on the hillside. Good floral fragrance all year round. Flowers are good food for the wind and rain. Grass grows by the stream. Green grass fragrance all year round. Gentle breeze and fine grass. The flowers tell you. Tell you. Flowers are your good example. The flowers tell you, tell you that flowers are your good example. Be strong physically and mentally. Practicing strengthens the mind and body. Flower tells you, tells you that flowers are your good example. Be strong physically and mentally. Practicing strengthen the mind and body, body to be healthy. Exercise makes you healthy. Flower blossom on the hillside. Good flower fragrance all year round. Flowers are good too for the wind and rain. Grass grows by the stream.
green grass begins all year round. Gentle breeze and fine grass. The flowers tell you, tell you that flowers are a good example. Be strong physically and mentally. Practice strengthens the mind and body. The flower tells you, tells you. Flowers are your good example. A body. Practice strengthens the mind and body. Body to be healthy. Exercise makes you healthy. Another song. Every day, vegetarian meals. Body and mind healthy. Happy and do healthy exercise. Pity everlasting. The second volunteer leads the way. Community care does not lag behind. Pity, pity everlasting. Pity, pity everlasting. Elderly stronger the young. Too easy and cheap with joy to know. City forever. Heart with love and we love everyone that we meet. They are fantastic. They are fantastic. Everyone is fantastic. Even the 90 years old is healthy and fit. Smart, good news, and eyesight. Recycling volunteers lead the way. Community care does not let behind. Wonderful things and good luck are happening here and there. Sweet, forever, everlasting. Everybody are stronger than the young. Peace and peace with treasures. We love in our heart. We love everyone that we meet. He is fantastic and fantastic. Everyone is fantastic. Sixty forever. For for health and peace and harmony. This song has been quite some time, the lyrics is written by Rodolin and the composer. I wasn't aware that it was written by his brother. And so this uh, lyrics writer said, can I use this song for your activity? 
后副总本身因为没有在听流行歌曲，他完全不知道这个人是有一点点能量的人，在流行音乐界，杨子福先生。所以呢，我一看到他，然后他曾经谱过的词曲，跟我们一些呢艺人的一个合作，我就张大眼睛，然后大口的说：“天哪、啊，竟然是他哦，为我们做的曲哦，是啊。”所以挺期待哈、哦，所以非常非常有这样的一个好意思，也感恩副总，谢谢地狱副总林俊贤副总帮我们这样的一个事情，所以也请了人通过呃关系，然后找到。For us, and it was a famous person in this musical area. We are grateful for this affinity with this person. Many people have been in quarantine for 21 days, but it has been a blessing in the past 21 days. But it has been a blessing in the past 21 days. But it has been Brother and Brother Ren Chen have uh is healthy twenty one day isolation as a healthy way to uh nurture nurture the good habits so that uh they develop these healthy habits and after twenty one days they are able to continue with these good habits so isolation with love and care. Yeah, isolation is not bad. Is really treat it as a holiday. You 真是好笑了，哈。也会穿。他说，呃，北无论是北京、北江或台北，满脸自信、温暖、亲切笑容的徐金文青，总是带给全球书友满满的正能量和多元丰饶的。Yeah, but the chin, Ren Jian and wife have always give a positive energy. To everyone, Canada team wished that they could uh, reach here uh, physically for the uh, sharing. Good. 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 呃，山东威海的王慧，他讲说“富润屋，德润身”。这个是三月九号，就是他针对这一次是华容师姐，他说非常感恩，因为上次认识的这一位大菩萨，他从 Yes,、uh, these are the good reviews, positive reviews from our mainland China family members. Yes,、uh, they are giving、uh, positive feedbacks to our speakers, our sharers in the pre previous session. 所以他，and form good of affinities with many people, and she'll be teaching the art of tea, and also sharing about filial piety to many people. And then this is another positive com feedbacks. About our Jingshi Abun Master, De Zi, and about her, our volunteers' personal encounter with Zi Shi Fu, with Master Zi, who was very compassionate and a very kind master. 就是这样的一个幽默的一个分享，由衷的肃然起敬，就跟随他。And、uh, they were all very moved and touched by all the sharings. And this is、uh, another feedback about our sharer. 
And this, there was a, a news from the、uh, Thai TV in Indonesia, and、uh, she was very impressed with this with the news, and she shared with her friends, and about how Tsuji had helped many people,、uh, not just、uh, in Indonesia but also in India during the、uh, COVID uh, pandemic. And the next one is another、uh, review by our brother. He said that、uh, he said about the Indonesia Thai TV station.、Uh, he was very. Uh, he was also very impressed with the reports and the uh, the uh, medical uh, the medical professionals helping out in India. Yes, he was a、uh, full full of praise for the、uh, these volunteers helping out in these countries. And this is a、uh, another written review by a sister、uh, who was commenting on how some of our seniors volunteer sisters they took good care of their own family as well as the、uh, society, the families of many, and she had learned a lot from this. Uh, senior sisters, and she was also grateful to our uh, sister Ziqing and brother Wenqing for their wonderful sharing. Okay, unfortunately, today our team from Holy、uh, was not able to come in person physically. So,、uh, in replacement, we have the、uh, prison care team who will be sharing with us. And yeah, there will be a few sharers today. And the team for cultivation of few blessings today is the shimmering light in the high wall. And the sub team is the way home. Venerable Master, Abbot Master, good morning to all members around the world.、Uh, my name is、uh, Hu Fengqing, and and during、uh, since 2018, I have been assigned to the Yancao Rehabilitation Center to be a volunteer to care for the、uh, inmates. As Master said, everyone has a function, a role to play. Even a chopsticks, a pair of chopsticks, a bowl, will also have their own abilities and functions. And in the、uh, rehabilitation center, we have established two classes of Jing Shi aphorism, and there is also a class、uh, to read. The、uh, Sutra of、uh, Treasury, Earth Treasury Bodhisattva,、uh, to perform the musical adaptation, and the team will always、uh, have a discussion before we visit the center, and what are the follow-ups and which are the、uh, inmates that we should、uh, have special care. And today I would like to share. Uh, yes. Uh, about A Yi, Lin Jing Yi. He is a classmate of the student of the Earth Treasury Bodhisattva Sutra class in the detention center. When he was released from prison,、uh, he came to Jing Shi Hall with his parents, as he wanted to give himself a chance. Because one of his、uh, classmate or prison mate, Du、uh, Wenzhong, 
uh, had told him that if he wanted to change after being released, he should look for c h i j i people who can help you and make a drift difference in your life. So on March the first, 2021, Ayi's parents went to the rehab center to pick up uh, Ayi upon his release and went directly to Jing Si Hall. So when they came to Jing Si Hall, our team had already waited uh, for them. We took the family to worship uh, the Buddha, and then took them to the bookstore to talk about Ayi's plans, and um, and also to help him find a job. Actually, all of us, it's easy for us to return home. You know, just take a bus or ride a bike. Uh, we can always go home. But for for our inmates in the in the uh, detention center, when we were reading their letters, we found that a lot of them uh, were regretted. You know, to be. You know, to be in the uh, center, and they had long to go home. However, it's always too late, and the journey is very, very long. It may take years, and the family no longer trusts them or accepts them. For them, home is a very longing but far away, as the family no longer trusts them, because they have gone in and out of prison too many times. So our team worked together to conduct the classes, hoping that they could go home upon their release, to go home and visit their parents, and to for their parents to accept them and give them another chance to renew their life. So when we got to know about Ai's situation, we also helped him to find a job. And we ask Ai to offer a cup of tea to his parents, and to repent sincerely, and vow to change, to change himself. So at that time, his mother was very touched and here. You can see that uh, Ai gave a warm hug to both his parents. It has been such a long time. And then we discuss with Ai about how to help him to find a job, and what kind of job that is suitable for him. And after he went home, we even accompany him to go for interview at the factory. And uh, Ai Ai managed to get a job, and started to work in a factory, and he started to become a vegetarian. And he is a very kind person. He's not good at expressing himself. And uh, after getting to know his colleagues, co-workers in the factory, he started to to share with them about the benefits of vegetarian. And so now some of the aunties and mothers uh, uh, in the factory, well, they have also started vegetarian. And Ai would now uh, help. His mother at the market uh, to sell the uh, the the plants, the potter plants. And uh, during his vacation, uh, we will also ask Ayi to come along with us, you know, to to go and contribute himself among the people. And actually, everyone are the same. And. We really hope that we uh, we are the support for Ai. We told him that he can always uh, depend on us for his support. And his biggest wish is that his family can be harmonious, and for his parents to buy a new house again. Because of his past mistakes, their parents had lost their home, lost their their house. 
So he wished that his younger sister can forgive him and help his parents to buy a house again. So we never give up in accompanying Ayi, who is a re reborn person. We really hope our team can give him the full support. And today, Ayi's mother is here. Let's ask uh, Ayi's mother. You know, ever since Ayi is released from prison, since last year, March, till now for a year, uh, what is the Ayi's mother's uh, feelings? And let's take a listen. Uh, she said that she doesn't know how to express herself. But ever since Ayi's returned home till now, she, she have never seen uh, Ayi's past uh, behaviors. Because in the past, when Ayi made mistakes too many times, the, the parents wanted to give up. But ever since this time when she, when she comes back, Ayi wanted to go to Jingsi Hall. And I'm so grateful to our city volunteers for accompanying Ayi and guided him to return to the right path. I'm very grateful to all. Yes, I'm very, very touched. Yes, this is a good affinity. If And Ayi's father uh, had to undergo a surgery for his kidney, kidney stone. So now we wish that we wish that his father's uh, medical result is it's good today. So we are grateful for that. And next is uh, Brother Jiang Yuehua. And previously I was a Qiqing, a part-time Qiqing. And I was certified as commissioner in 2006. In the past, when I was young, I was radical and ignorant. I used to be a Qiqing by day and a gang member at night. And one time I almost lost my life during the, the debt collection, one of the debt collection case, which made me to reorientate my life and found the right path. Just when everything started to go smoothly, Two years ago, because the company I worked for uh, accidentally got into the legal troubles. And even myself was thrown into prison because of this. Ever since my release, I was welcomed by the team and accompanied me. And when when I contemplate uh, my activities, I realize that on uh, Wednesday afternoon, I'm available and, and I'll be able to contribute back to the prison care team. And when I, when I uh, go back to visit the prison, as a volunteer, uh, I was concerned that I may not be able to, to guide them. However, I realized that I could share with them my experience and encourage them to go back to Jing Si Hall, go back to Ci Ji when they are released. And uh, and I will be able to, to meet them because I will, I will be volunteering at our Jing Si Book store. And I will be able to go and meet these uh, 
ex inmates who, who will come to Jing Si Hall and I'll be I can interact and 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 talk to them. So I'm able to contribute back what I have received in the past and to contribute back to our our new in uh, release uh, ex inmates. So now I'm passing over to our next uh, brother for sharing. Uh, grateful to everyone in the world, in the world. Grateful to Master for not giving up on me. Master did not uh, give up on me due to my ignorant past. He yeah, accepted me, changed and transformed me and recycled me. Today, uh, yes, I'm able to transform myself. And our prison care team gave given me a strong faith and they believe in me and given me hope. And when I was in the Pingtung prison, I heard Master's teaching that there is no evil person in this world. It's just that we have, there are only people who made mistakes. But Master never, Master never gave up on me. Master just say, you are only, you have only made mistakes. You are not a bad person. So I would like to share my stories with all the other inmates. When I was released from the prison and I went home to kneel down to my parents and repent to my parents. So with that experience, I vowed that every image that were released, I will want to accompany them to go home and to repent to their parents. When I walk into the prison, I represent a hope to the students there. And I want to share Master's Dharma to all of them and to let them have the hope and that they are not alone in walking the journey, especially when they were released. And we have uh, Brother Huang Ming Chao who joined our team and giving us a lot of inspiration. And Brother Ming Chao shared his own personal experience in a prison and that has uh, moved other inmates. And just now we heard that Ai mentioned that Brother Tu Zhongwen had told him that if he want to really repent and renew his life, he must go to Jing Si Hall. And that is the strength that you will get to accompany you so that you will not walk back to the past. And uh, brother Zhong Wen, also a uh, an ex inmate, and uh, he he committed uh, violated the law by firing shots, gunshots to the at the police station, and then he was in prison. And when he was. Uh, when he joined our class, he couldn't believe that there would be anyone who would accept him. And our our brother says that I have been in prison for six times, in and out. So, and I'm still able to be accepted by Ciji. So, brother Jiong Yuan gave him hope and encouraged him and to listen to Dharma and to have the right Dharma to guide his life. So with the team's effort and our teachers, 
Dharma teachers, we are able to accompany Zhongmen uh, and to, to let him join the uh, Sutra adaptation uh, musical. And one time when we were visiting the prison, one of our sister, one of our sisters says that uh, she wanted to share the uh, Master Cheng Yan's commentary on the Elf Treasury Bodhisattva Sutra. So it's it so happened that yeah, one of the one of the teacher because of the vow by our sister to share this sutra, and the other this was a teacher that was sitting at the same table as us, and uh, who heard this and agree, you know, to conduct this class. So we opened, we started this class, and it's open to all. And when and some of the students, were, after learning the sutra, they decided to become vegetarian, and they even promote promote vegetarianism to many to many others and even encourage the other inmates to donate, to donate their stamps, the post-it stamps, to, to help the needy. And he had collected many donor members within the prison. So now uh, this uh, brother Zhong Wen has been transferred to another prison in Tainan, and he continued to even he continues to spread the seeds of goodness uh, to the other inmates in the the other prison. This painting, this painting was drawn by uh, uh, brother Tu Zhongwen, and due to the the Ukraine war, ongoing war, and hearing that Ciji is raising funds to help the Ukraine refugees. So uh, Brother Tu Zhongwen uh, drawn this painting for the charity auction to raise funds for the Ukraine refugees. And and finally, the painting was taken to the charity sale and, and sold at a high price of 12,000 NT dollars. And we went to visit uh, Tu Zhong Wen's parents. Okay, let's watch a short video clip. This is uh, Tu Zhong Wen's uh, mother. So our sister asked her mother, would you allow Zhong Wen to come home when he was released? The mother said, yes. But if do you have space for him to sleep? The mother says, oh, we, we can make the arrangement. And, and yes, we will welcome, always welcome him home because he's our son. And because of this, Affinity, Tu uh, Zhong Wen has gained more strength. Previously, he he was uh, he, he was given up by his family, but now he has renewed himself and become a new person and have gained greater strength. And for myself. For myself too, my parents, my father had given up on me previously and told our volunteers that this person is useless. There's no way you can change him back. And now I realize that 
I can change and I could help many others to change using Master's Dharma. Thank you, everyone. Grateful to Brother Ye Huang sharing. So the next, the second team that will be shared with us today is from the Ping Tong Prison Team, and the team is the Power of Belief. Good afternoon to everyone. And we are from the Ping Tong Prison Care Team. My name is Mei Hui. Dharma name Chi Mo. This is our sister Li Li Yuan. And Dharma name is Li Yong. And I'm here to, to continue our story. The last time we share the story of one person in prison, 10 person uh, in gambling. And whenever a mother visits a son in prison, it is a very, it's a very touching moment and we can, we could feel for the mother and the emotions. So firstly, I would like to share this Jing Si aphorism. We wish that every inmate when released have a, have a sense of going home. So this one time when my car broke down along the along the way to Jing Si Hall, and uh, when I reached Jing Si Hall, uh, the brother Ye Huang helped me to uh, solve the my car problem, and I was very grateful, and I could feel the sense of coming home. Jing uh, aphorism says that in this world, there is no children that cannot be taught. There's only parents or teachers who have not find, found the right way. And when we visit the inmates in a prison, our interaction with them, it's full of sincerity and warm. And there are many, many touching stories and photos. And you can see that this is the during the musical adaptation of the uh, compassionate uh, Samadhi Dhamma Water, the Repentance Sutra. And since uh, 2011, until now, it has been 11 years. We have accompanied five commissioners. And you can see that the person in the middle, in the center, is brother Wu Sao Ming. He's a newly, newly uh, commissioned uh, citizen. When he was released from prison the last, the last time, his sister came to receive him and the sister asked him, this time round, when you are out, what do you want to do? And he said that. And Sao Ming said that, sister, sister, this time when I'm out, I want to do Ji. He is very firm. And with a firm voice that he wants to do Ji. His sister was shocked, surprised, and couldn't believe it. Are you crazy? How can there be such a good organization to accept you? So does everyone think that there is such a good organization and people in this world? Yes, definitely. And so, Brother Sao Ming start to uh, attend the trainings and 
to uh, participate in in all the activities, and finally, he became a commissioner last year. And since uh, since June 2019, he went back to Hualien. I was since about Hualien. Since then until now, he has been uh, attending the early wisdom, early Dharma. Uh, wisdom classes until now, and he's still doing it at home through online until today. Very diligent uh, bodhisattva, and we can learn from him. And Master says that sincerity and and righteousness could subdue. All the stubbornness and in, in human being. So we should be humble and uh, bend our uh, bend our backs, be very gentle and bow down. And this is the uh, other form of dignity, uh, dignified appearance to touch the uh, the fellow inmates. And through our actions, our self examples, we are able to touch the inmates. These were the past stories that we have shared. Today, we will share a new story. Uh, I'd like to ask everyone and everyone online: When it was, when you, when it's raining, what would you do? Oh, I'll take out an umbrella. Oh, I will run away from the rain to take shelter. Would you, would you go into the rain, or would you leave the rain? Most people would say that. Yeah, I would. I will take out an umbrella or hide in the shelter to avoid the rain. But now I'd like to share this story, a very touching story. When I was in prison, I met, I met a, an inmate. His sentence is 21 years imprisonment. And his crime was murder. And he had been there for 11 years. And there's still another halfway to go. So I asked him, what I asked him, what is the first thing you want to do after you get out of prison? And this inmate Zhao said, I want to get in the rain. What? You want to get in the rain? Everybody wants to avoid the rain. Why? Why do you want to get in the rain? Can you imagine a person who has been in prison for more than 10 years? And have never been exposed to the rain and longing to the feeling of being in the rain. I think this is a kind of uh, a heart wrenching feeling when one does not have the freedom. This kind of feeling is it's just like what Ayi's mother, how she felt when she kept waiting, when she was waiting for her son to be released. And our Jing Si aphorism is really a very wondrous medicine to purify the minds of. And one time, there was this inmate. We gave him a, a homework to write an essay. The, the title is The Three Things That Make Me the Happiest the Most. And so he wrote that. The third happiest moment he had is when he came to learn Jing Si aphorism. He learned that being angry is taking someone else's fault and punishing yourself. And because of this Jing Si aphorism, it made him change his thinking. Because in the past, when he was sleeping, the his roommate will accidentally knock him and woke him up. So he got very angry. And then he and he was angry, he couldn't sleep. 
and he was complaining. And but the other roommate、uh, went back to sleep, and so he couldn't. He couldn't sleep peacefully until dawn, and had insomnia, and couldn't sleep during the day,、uh, and caused him to be hot tempered. So he felt that this Qing Shi aphorism uh, uh, made him tell him himself not to be angry. And now at night, when his roommates wakes him up, even when he wakes up, he will turn over and not be angry, and soon he will fall back to sleep again. So, isn't our Qing Shi aphorism such a wondrous medicine? Thank you. Very grateful to our Fu Xin, our prison care team, and our sister、uh, Xin Ling from Canada says that there are hope beyond the walls of the high walls of the prisons. So we are always, we should always welcome all the release inmates. Let's give a big round of applause to the accompanying prison care team. And we have we received many many comments uh, after uh, Sister Zi Qing and when Brother Wen Qing's sharing just now. And both of them are so powerful. And they they keep themselves healthy by exercising every day. And through their experience of being in isolation, they have transformed isolation into something useful and something that's full of heartwarming feelings. We're grateful to.、Uh, Brother Wen Qing, Sister Zi Qing, to accompany our volunteers in、uh, Chongqing, in mainland China. And their spirit of and and、uh, so this volunteer brother said he will write a he will write an article、uh, for twenty one weeks every time after the.、Uh, Kaohsiung book study. And there's so many、uh, positive comments from many many volunteers from all over China. Oh, due to the short shortage of time. Yeah, we will compile it and send it to all of you later. You can see this picture, the the full rainbow. Yes, this rainbow is protecting our Jing Shi, uh, Jing Shi product factory. These are our products from Jing Shi, our new products. It's to bring us、uh, good health. And this is a detergent from Jing Shi that could remove stains and grimes and dirt. And this is the yes. Please go to our Jing Shi bookstore to see what are the items available. And we hope we all of us could love our Jing Shi products and、uh, and be、uh, be healthy. And this is a ginger powder, turmeric, turmeric ginger powder with black pepper. Yes, it's very very healthy. This is the latest turmeric black pepper powder. Yes, a very special price. Okay, who will we have next week? Yes, we have our brother、uh, Tai Zheng Hang from Philippines, and we will also have Sister Ya Qi from South Africa. And this is from our artists association and our doctors. 
And this is our new Thai drama uh, that is that was come to share with us from May 18. And these are the actress that we are very familiar with. And the director will also be coming in person to share with us. So every Wednesday, it's so grateful. Let's all say this together. I like to be with you because you have such positive energy. There's only beauty that can be that can be achieved through actions and not glory that is to be waited. Yes. Let's meet again every Wednesday. Yes, please. Please like and share. Thank you, Andrew. You covered yeah, yeah. everything. No problem, because it's almost